Alright guys, what is going on? Welcome back to another video on the self-developed YouTube channel, you beautiful people. As always, comment down below, hashtag self-developed army, or where are you from, what time is it, and let's get this video going. So guys, in this one, I believe I titled it, Be Close Minded. Yep, be close minded. Now I know a lot of people are going to watch this, hell, even I would watch this a year from now and kind of shame myself. David, what do you mean be closed-minded? You've always promoted, and society always promotes for you to be as open-minded as possible, and there is merit in this 100%. You should be open-minded with ideas, actions, habits that are going to benefit your life, or at least you have this alert to. You're intrigued by it, right? If you want to start fitness or powerlifting, of course, be open-minded to learning, to adapting, to molding, to ultimately what? Level yourself up, right? But the exact opposite <laughs> happens. And I would argue it happens. Well, I don't have to argue with it. You can kind of see if yourself out in the world stage. Uh, the opposite happens. And because people are so open-minded, right? Everything comes and goes. Like Plato, they're being played with. <laughs> and yeah, it's, it's kind of fucked up. It's kind of scary. Now look, obviously this is going to affect all of us. We are all going to be played with. We're all malleable to a certain extent, myself, you guys, and that's okay. When I say be closed-minded, you as a man in particular, if you're to go anywhere in life, you must build a certain structure for yourself and stick to that. You know, you have to be closed-minded to a certain extent. I'll give you, you know, a tangible example. If you are busy focusing on your fitness or your business, your side passion, and your friends friends, right? They continuously poke at you to come out and, I don't know, hang out, drink, smoke, whatever it may be. Well, in that case, if you were not closed-minded, the passion would stop. The fitness would stop. Do you understand? Now, I want you to apply that, that discipline, you could say. Really, it's just being closed-minded. <laughs> and apply that to all areas of your life. Now, look, the point of this video is not to say fuck off to people or to be a hermit up in the hills. No, dude, like have friends, build amazing relationships. But mark my words, guys, if you are to go anywhere in life, in your fitness, in your business, in your passions, your crafts, your relationships, anything worthwhile in life, you will have to create, hold on to, and be close-minded to anything else swaying you from that. I'll give you some tangible examples in my life, right? Now, when I was building up this YouTube channel, Self Developed, which has close to 200,000 subscribers, it's my full-time job, and uh, I couldn't be happier. I fucking love it. <laughs> if I wasn't closed-minded, I would have quit this a long time ago. I had so many influences around me, internally, externally, telling me to stop, telling me that it's not worth it, it's stupid, it's, uh, you know, it's not going to go anywhere, it's not real. And thank God, I was a closed-minded motherfucker to a lot of these individuals. And am, I still am, a very closed-minded to a lot of things. And that is the reason I believe I'm here. Right? The same with you guys. So look, the reason I make this video, because David, why don't we all just be open-minded? Right? And don't get me wrong, there's a time and a place to be open-minded, 100%, when it is there to benefit your life. Or you have this natural intrigue. Do you understand? You're curious. Well, then move with it, explore it, of course, right? But we live in a society nowadays, guys, where we are so far, I don't want to get political, but we are so far to one spectrum that I can come out with a study, <laughs> give it to everybody, and they'll believe it like that. I can come out with a product, I can come out with I can come up with whatever the fuck I want to come up with. I can shit something out and give it to people and they'll believe it without thinking twice because that's how open-minded people are. You need to have a balance with this, okay? Now you can apply this to areas like that or smaller areas, but at the end of the day, I truly believe there is this lack of closed-mindedness, <laughs> right? It's not about being rude. It's not about being mean. It's not about eh, shrugging people off. Not at all, not at all. It's about sticking, or I should say a finding, something in your life you want to strive towards, and then sticking to that, not swaying. Yes, you can adapt, but only if it intrigues you, if it feels right. Otherwise, don't let all these social influences just continuously tinker with you, because believe me, that's what will happen. 
That's in our DNA to do that to people. I'm no different. We want to manipulate and control people. This is what we do. We want power. All of us do. So you have to be there, kind of like Kratos, right? Yeah, yeah that's, a, that's a great analogy. I love that. <laughs> have you guys seen or played God of War? What is it, four or five? The newest one, right? Where he has Atreus, his son. He's got a big beard, right? Atreus, come here. <laughs> now, if you played it in the beginning, right? Anyways, probably the majority of you haven't. But in the beginning of the video, Kratos protects his house because there's this intruder. And he does everything he can to protect his house because he has to protect his child, his life. If Kratos was to just be like, ah, oh, you know what, it's okay, yeah, come on in. He would have got killed like that. His son would have got killed like that. Everything would have been destroyed. But he fought tooth and nail. I think a lot of us need to be more like Kratos. So now we have this son coming up. Again, I'm not saying you have to kill people. It's just a video game. But there has to be a balance. And uh, maybe this is something I am still working on, right? Without a doubt. But if you want to achieve anything worthwhile in your life, you cannot be so open that you continuously change paths. You will go nowhere and you're gonna be doing circles. Right guys? So find something, be dogmatic, be closed-minded and just stick to that day in, day out. Yes, adapt, but only if it intrigues you. Sorry guys, the monitor just died so the camera just shut off <laughs> out of nowhere. Uh, that is it guys, thank you so much for watching this. I love you all, I appreciate you guys. I, uh, I'm i so excited to just have these more raw chats with you. You know, maybe it's the fall energy, maybe it's a maturity thing, I don't know, right? But uh, I appreciate you guys, so uh, that's it. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to give it a thumbs up, comment and subscribe. I'll finish it here guys with the final plugs. If you guys are interested in any of the topics I speak of or would like to work with me on a personal level, you guys know what's up. There's one-on-one -on -one coaching in the course, but what I'm gonna be promoting here is that middle rung, the workshop. I know a lot of you guys have probably been on the edge, intrigued with the workshop. Well, we are going live with the one of September this Sunday, okay? The workshop, guys, I truly mean it, is the best bang for your buck. I've made it very affordable, probably too affordable, to be honest. I've been told that many times. Um, and it's for one hour live stream group coaching calls with myself and a small group of men. I only take on a handful, five to seven of you, and there's still some spots left. So if you guys are interested, I would strongly recommend it. Click the link down below. Come join us of September and let's just vibe. Four one hour calls. Let's go deep, guys. Improve everything on our fitness, business, mindset, and relationships. And I'll, uh, I'll see you guys there, okay? You can always support Edge. Coupon code Hammond. Rock in their uh, everyday shorts with their lifestyle tee. Super basic. I love it. You don't always need flashy stuff. And uh, yeah, that's it. Thank you guys. Have an amazing day. Till then. Peace.